fitting the fuel injection fans against the carburetor fans. We score a point for the latter with the Dr. Z400S and Dr. Z400SM from Suzuki. Fuel injection hadn't yet made an appearance in any of Suzuki's 2017 dual sport lineup, which was a good thing or a bad thing, depending on which side of the fence you're on. For 2018, the Dr. Z siblings haven't yet been touched by the FI update. Sharing the same engine as the 500 EXC from KTM, the Dr. Z's come on a different chassis with progressive link rear suspension. The SM, the supermoto of the family, and the S feature a 6-liter air box with quick-release fasteners trouble-free access to the air filter and special low-profile mirrors that rotate hoping to avoid damage. Both are pluses when you're playing in the dirt. Honestly, most dual sport bikes lean one way or the other and the manufacturer will offer a street-oriented version and a dirt-oriented version of the same bike. Maybe a difference in riding modes, with and without skid plates, with and without handguards, et al. Both are capable on and off-road, but setups and components kind oriented one way or the other. Suzuki is no different here and knowing what you want to do with the bike makes the decision for you on which model to get without having to blow the budget in the accessories catalog.